I am here to tell you how to address every situation in your life at 12 a.m. Hello, welcome back to my channel and page. If you're just joining me for the first time, I am Oka Fotochi. I am here to tell you how to tackle your problem, how to settle every situation that you find yourself in at 12 a.m. as a midnight. Just pay attention to this video and watch till the end, okay? Please help me share this video and like. And please, if you have not subscribed to my channel, please subscribe and turn on the notification bell to get notified each time I upload a new content. If you are a returning subscriber, thank you so much for your support. My God will bless you. If you are following me from, me from Facebook, please follow this page for more. Like and comment. Okay. Now, let's read Genesis chapter 1, 27 and 28. Genesis chapter 1. Verse 27 and 28 said, So God created man in his own image. In the image of God, he created him. Male and female, he created them. 28. Then God blessed them and said to them, Be fruitful and multiply. Fill the earth and subdue it. Have dominion over the fish of the sea, over the birds of the air, and over every living thing that moves on the earth. He said, we should have dominion over everything, that we should multiply and be fruitful. So, whatever that is your problem, any situation you find yourself in, first of all, you should know that you are created by the image of God, you as a man, you as a woman. Because he specified it here, he and the she. He gave them power. He made them to have dominion over everything. So whatever that it is, that is your problem. Whenever that you remember that I am made of, I am, I am same as God. Because you are made at the, by the image of God. When you remember that, that power that God have, that he has given you power on your own. Whatever that it is that is your problem, that is giving you sleepless night, that is giving you tears, that is making you not to sleep or not to rest in your life, the best thing to do is wake up by 12 a.m. Like I told you, mighty things, great things happens at this time of the day. This is the day, this is the time that you settle your problems. This is the time that the enemies create problems for you. So whenever you find yourself in any form of situation, anything at all, remember that I am same as God. God has given me power and he has said that I should have dominion over everything, including that your problem, including that powers that are subduing you, including that problem that is causing you sleepless nights. He said that you should subdue Remember, he said, you should subdue. The ones that you have to subdue are those ones that are tormenting you. Those ones that are causing you problems. Those ones that are giving you sleepless nights. Subdue them by the power in the name of Jesus Christ. Speak a word into that situation of yours. Say that this is how I want my life to be. Claim it. Always pray about it. And your life is going to be like that. And like I told you, always speak positive things about your life. Speak positivity into your, exist your existence in life and you will find yourself being positive in everything. But when you keep having double mind, when you don't know who you are, you don't know that God has given you dominion over everything. That is when you, you still be crying over your problems. That is when you still be running from one place to another. That is when you will be having in mind that your own case has finished. Let me tell you, God said that surely they shall gather, but since their gathering is not of God, that they shall scatter. Mind you that for the fact that you are made of, you are made of from the image of God, you are God's, you are mini God, you are mini God. And whatever that God can handle, you can handle it. If it is too much for you, call on him, remind him his word, that he said he has given you dominion, that he has given you powers to have dominion over everything. That everything includes your problem. That everything includes that powers that are tormenting you. That everything includes that generational cause. That problem includes that sickness. That thing that is causing you stunted growth. That thing that is causing you to be stagnant, not to move in life, not to make any progress. Always believe that as long as the Lord liveth, as long as I am a mini God, 
no power, no power, nothing can stop you from rising. And nothing can quench your glory. Nothing can take your glory. Only if you believe in God. Only if you know who you are. Get up at midnight. Tackle that problem. Tackle that problem. Don't be sleeping while people are there. Destroying your own. Taking away what belongs to you. Having dominion over you. Because when you are sleeping, your enemies will have dominion over you. But when you remember that God has given you power to have dominion over all these things, you will rise and fight the battle. And you are going to win. You will surely win. As long as you are fighting by the power in the name of Jesus Christ, you are going to win. Don't let your problem bring you down. Don't let your problem weigh you down. Don't let that problem, because surely more problems must come. They must come. But the way you tackle it, the way you address it, will make it not to reoccur. So mind you that you are, go, you, you are God's own. You are a mini God. And whatever that you proclaim into your life, so shall it be in your life. And I pray for you today that whatever that it is that is still a problem in your life, that is giving you sleepless nights, that is making you not to know that you are a mini God, by the power in the name of Jesus Christ, let those things be destroyed in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. I declare that today you shall experience growth in everything that you are doing, that you will progress in everything that you are doing in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. And I also declare that you, have the, you receive the healing of God if you are sick. May the healing of the Almighty God touch you. And from today, may you receive total healing and be healed in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Thank you, ancient of days, for I know you have done it for us. May your name alone be glorified now and forever. In Jesus' mighty name I have prayed. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Please help me share this video. Like and comment. Please share. If you're watching me from uh, YouTube, please subscribe to my channel and turn on the notification bell to get notified each time I upload any content. If you're a returning subscriber, thank you so much for your support. If you're watching me from Facebook, please follow this page for more, okay? Help me share. My God will bless you. See you in my next video. Bye for now.